Yeah, yeah, at least you'll have it. All right, all right. Okay, so we are recording. So welcome, welcome, everyone. My name is Quinn Mitchell. And Victoria and I thought it would be a good idea if we did some type of lunch and learn as uh, I did kind of like a spur of the moment a, a webinar on last, was it last week? I think it was last week, right, Victoria? I think it was last week, yeah. <laughs> yeah. And so, you know, it was, again, it was a spur of the moment. And then, you know, I had some thoughts because here's what really happened. I woke up. I woke up in the morning, I looked at my phone, and I saw that through my webinar that I was planning that I just made money. Someone just enrolled enrolled while I was sleeping. Uh, they enrolled, and with the enrollment, you know, there's a fee that they're paying. And so when I woke up, I was like, oh, wow, you know, and that felt good. <laughs> it feels good to wake up in the morning, and, and especially if you're trying to do some type of business on your own and, and you can roll out of bed and look and check. It's like, oh, I just made money. So <laughs> I, I, I did that, and I said, wow, you know what, let me, you know, let me share with some of the people. And, again, it was kind of spur of the moment. Um, you know, hey, you could be making extra money with these webinars, you know. So I started talking about webinars a few weeks back, about a month ago maybe. Uh, yeah, blessing constant says, well, you make money with, when you're sleeping, right? <laughs> it's definitely a good feeling. <laughs> so so started on this kick about webinars because here's the thing, that I've been doing webinars, but more so as a virtual training class in the corporate world. And I'll share some a little bit about that in a little bit. But, you know, once I start doing this and it started taking off and leaps and bounds in the corporate world, I'm saying, wait a minute, you know, I got to be able to do this at home as well. And I had already been doing some some training at home uh, over the phone for a fee. And so I already had the content. So it just made sense of, of what I was doing at work that I could implement some of the same strategies and do it at home. Um, so that's what kind of kind of got me started with doing webinars at home because I was like, man, I'm doing it at work. It just makes sense. So. And then at work, you know, I'll talk a little bit more in depth, but, uh, you know, at work, these are seven, eight hour long classes for a week at a time. Some some of them are five days at a time, three days at a time. And people are paying, you know, twenty five hundred dollars or so uh, for for one of those classes. So real quick, because we're going to be talking about texting as well, text marketing. If you can just look at your screen there, if you can go ahead and send a text to uh, to the the number 313131, send a text to 313131, and in that message area there, type in the, the message, you know, EZNHV05160, and then a space, lunch with Quinn. Now, I'm going to explain what all that means and why I've got this funky looking, you know, uh, uh, short code there. Well, not a short code. There's three, 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 one, three, one, three, one, three, one, three, one is a short code um, keyword. We'll talk about the keywords in short code. Looks like Tanya is in, just joined us as well. So go ahead and text to three, one, three, one, three, one. In the message, type in EZN HV zero five one six zero, and then space lunch with Quinn. All one word. Doesn't matter. It's not case sensitive. And the reason why I'm doing this is because we're talking, we're going to be talking about text marketing, and I want you to see what it's like. I want you to, I want you to understand a little bit about, you know, keywords, short keywords, short codes, and sub keywords, and all that. What all that means. I'm going to explain a lot of that. Okay. All right. So let's dive in a little bit, a little bit about first of all who I am. You know, I'll give you a few thoughts about. Um, yep. Go back to the code again. Yep. So the code, the short code, you text to, text to 313131. So I'm texting to, like a phone number, 313131. And in your message, type in the EZNH V05160. Uh, Looks like Bernice is joining us. So what's up, Bernice? What's up, uh, Tanya? Looks like you just joined us. This is pretty cool. Uh, lunch and learn. Here we go. Lunch and learn. So again, easy and HV05160 space lunch with Quinn. Go ahead and text to 313131. Enter that in as a message. 
simply because we're going to be talking about texting, text marketing. I want to show it to you, explain it to you. All right. Ready to roll? Who's ready to roll? Go ahead and send me a message there in the chat area. Say I'm ready. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Constance says she's ready. Here we go. So I'm going to talk a little bit about real quick. I'm just dive in real quick about who I am. Talk a little bit about some webinar statistics, and going to give you a few, a couple of reasons of, to use webinars, and then we'll dive into the text messaging, uh, text marketing. So we've got about 25 minutes to do it. I'm going to try to do it in like 20 minutes, and then open up 15 minutes, maybe 15 minutes, and then open up and see who. Uh, has questions. There you go. Victoria says she just got the message there. All right. So there you go. All right. So why me? Real quick. So those that may not know, I am in ministry. I am married. It's my beautiful wife there. I am in, I do play saxophone as well. Recorded a few CDs. I've uh, been a minister for over 24 years. I work at a multi-billion dollar company full time and I'm a manager, manager of educational services with this company. And as my role as a manager, uh, we had some powwows with some of our other training managers from different sister companies and all. We met met down in, uh, there you go, Tanya, got the message there too. See, there you go. It's working, right? Uh, we were in Austin, and, and one of our sister companies were doing, uh, they were doing virtual training, and they were introducing virtual training to everyone and allowing them to see. So I'm like, man, this could work for us. I'm thinking, again, for my corporate job, and I came back home and, you know, Talked it over with some of the uh, my manager and all, and they kind of shot it down. Didn't see how it could work, and so I'm like, I know this thing could work. And then, about a year later, uh, touch bases with them again and says, this has got to work. We've got some programming classes, we've got some configuration type classes where you're just doing doing most of the work on the computer. Um, so I know that it could work. So. Bottom line, real short, over 1.5 years and a year and a half, we did over $200,000 in virtual training. And also because I have some home business experience, I created some training programs, trained sales and reps and recruiting. And then I've been doing some home study courses over the years, over 12 years, over the phone for a fee. And so I was able to implement some of those same strategies now that I started doing webinars. So in the corporate world, they know me as, they, they coined me as the virtual training evangelist. <laughs> okay, and that's the company that I work for. It's an Emerson company. But since 2015, we've done, uh, of October, we've done 21 virtual courses, about $90,000 in sales. Again, this is in the corporate world. Uh, over a year and a half, we had 18 different countries that were represented, people from all these different countries that were participating as students in our courses. So at home, again, I've been doing some of the training that I've been doing over the phone for over 12 years and just started doing introducing webinars back in March and April. And so just in April alone, I uh, was able to do some conversion from people who attended the webinars, converted them to sales, to actually enrolling in our courses, and just in April alone did $800 in sales. Now, to me, that's a very low number as far as dollars in sales, but uh, again, this was something new and uh, to the audience that I had. So let's dive right in and talk a little bit about webinars and just a couple of statistics. So if we were to say out of 100 people that said, yes, I'm coming to your webinar, that enrolled, they signed up, and they said, yes, I'm coming to your webinar, out of 100 people, 42% of the people actually showed up. Okay, this is a study that came from On24. Uh, this was a study back in 2013 that they did. And I don't know, and, and, and even looking at some of the statistics and all, those numbers still are about the same, even you know three years later, still about the same, about a good 40% of the people are going to show up after they've registered, they enrolled, they signed up some kind of way through your uh, lead page or whatever. Um, out of that 100 people, 42 actually show up. And then out of the 42 people that show up, um, well, let's just, you know, the people that showed up, so the, the people that actually registered, they actually registered the 42% of the people that show up, 64% of those, they registered the week before the webinar, the week before the webinar. Well, let's, let's, let's just think about the people that registered, just the people that registered, okay? Just the people that registered to say, yep, I'm coming. 64% of those register the week of the webinar. 
and then 36% of the people register more than a week before. Okay, so more than a week before people register, you, you've had it out there, you're advertising it, uh, more than a week before, 36% of the people are registering, okay, of those people who register. And of those, you know, so it's 36%. And then there's the 64% that registered the week of, okay? So if your, web, if your webinar is on a Thursday, you know, starting on Sunday through that Thursday, the week of, 64% of the people that registered, okay, they registered the week of. Now, there's the breakdown of the 64% that registered the week of, 27% two to seven days before, 16% the day before, and 21% the day of your webinar. 21% the day of the webinar. That's of those 64% that registered during that week, okay? So again, why do I say this? Is because your marketing and your messaging is critical. Now, I'm not going to be able to show you all the details of how to create and how to do your webinar. I'm going to do a class on that, and some of you have been checking out some webinars of how to, and I know what those dollars amounts are that they're paying, that you would pay for those courses. You're looking at about $1,000 total, um, and you're going to get a whole lot of content. You're going to get a lot of stuff there, okay? Um, this Lunch and Learn is not designed to do what they're doing. Okay, I'm going to have a separate class that's going to address those things, and it's going to be at a fraction of a cost of what those guys are charging. And I'm going to give you the nuts and bolts and the basics to get you started, get you going, where you can start making money online, or depending on what you're wanting to do with your webinar. So, again, we'll find out some more. Then I'm going to offer some coaching to go along with that package. So we're going to talk about that. That's going to be you know, coming up pretty soon. So, again, marketing and messaging is is just crucial. Once you saw, when you, know, when you see these numbers, of the percentage of the people that register and the percentage of the people that actually show up, then you know your marketing and your messaging has, has got to be critical. Now, I heard it said that people aren't going to make a decision to do things unless they see your advertisement between seven to ten times. <laughs> okay, I mean that's what marketing people tell you, and Marketing people will also, I had a, a marketing research analyst also had commented saying that uh, if you get 3% of people to act or do something based on your advertisement, 3% is huge, they're saying. That's what marketers say. Three, if you can capture 3%, that's a whole lot of you know people to them <laughs> as far as a return of investment, dollar-wise, and so on. So... 3%, man, that's a very low number, but that's what the marketing gurus tell you. So just think about your marketing, your messaging, how critical it is, how many times people are going to see it, touch it. Um, okay, so just kind of think about that. And let's just dive real quick into, because some people may not know and understand what a webinar is. For, for one, what we're on right now is a webinar. Okay, it's basically I'm doing a seminar, doing a lunch and learn. It's over the internet, and basically people can tap in from all over the world. Whoever has that invite has the link to be able to join. If they have a good, solid internet connection, then they're going to be able to join in on this type of webinar. So here's what a webinar is going to do for you. It's going to allow you to easily connect, easily engage, to present, to sell, to train, or whatever you're wanting to do to put you in face with your, you know, in touch and in your customer's face. Webinars is going to be the best way to do it, okay? I've done, again, network marketing. I've done that years and, and, uh, and you know, years ago and did a lot of cold calling over the phone and trying to get people to buy our product and sign up and be part of our team over the phone. I've done all of that. Uh, now that I've got webinars under my belt, I'm never doing that on a phone call unless they've already seen my webinar. And now I'm just following up with a phone call, okay? So, or unless, unless a person just says, hey, real quick, call me, okay? Otherwise, when I'm ready to engage and present and to sell or do any type of training, I'm using webinars, okay? And here's what, here's what researchers have found as well. It's the highest return and the shortest amount of time, the highest return of your investment and time 
and also being able to do this in the shortest amount of time. So for me to be able to fire up a webinar and be ready to, to you know, to launch it so, so that people, so that you all can come on, <clears throat> excuse me, um, it literally take, took me like two minutes, less than two minutes to fire up my webinar tool and I'm already ready to roll. Got my camera, got my headsets, click it, bang, it's up and I'm ready. All I gotta do is click on you know, this tool here uh, and copy the link and I can just email it to someone and then just like that, they're ready to jump in on my webinar. No traveling, no packing, no sending material in the mail. I don't have to do any of that. Matter of fact, with my webinars, um, the courses that I teach with that, when I use a webinar tool, um, I don't send anything in the mail. Okay, with the corporate world, yeah, we send a workbook, we send headphones, we send that in the mail to them. Uh, they're paying, you know, two thousand plus dollars for a course. You know, we'll do that. Normally, we would, you know, when they come here face to face, we would take them out to lunch. We'd feed them every day. So instead of feeding them every day, every day, and for them, they don't have to travel. They don't have to spend time, you know, and the money and all for traveling. It's a huge savings on their end, and plus it's savings on our end. So, um, and here's a message that we've been communicating as well to our customers in the corporate world. They can literally save up to 30% of their training budget, okay? People literally come to us for training. So keep that in mind. Um, here's what the Content Marketing Institute said, that 62% of all business-to-business -business marketers use webinars, and listen what it says, see what it says, to nurture their prospects, to nurture their prospects. 62% of business-to-business -business marketers, they use webinars to nurture their prospects. Um, webinars deliver more quality leads and have a higher conversion rate, leading to a higher return of investment. So uh, studies have been done and we're, you know, qualified leads, and sometimes it may even be less people coming in the funnel, but they're more qualified, okay? So again, when I was in network marketing, it was always about the numbers of people coming in the funnel, right? And there's spending a whole lot of time with people who aren't qualified. Well, webinars is gonna help you to qualify the leads. So real quick, when you do a webinar, then guess what? It instantly makes you the authority. <laughs> so right now, I'm doing this webinar, little experience under my belt, but it instantly makes me the webinar. You're coming on, you've got questions, you've got concerns. I have answers for you. I am able to provide some information to get you from here to here, okay? Um, and then bottom line is when you're doing webinars, you can potentially use this tool to be able to convert people into sales that could increase your bottom line. All right, so real quick, before we get into texting, what questions do you have about webinars? Who has questions about webinars? Victoria, did you have any questions you wanna lead off with or, or maybe kind of comment on some well, of those? Yep, go ahead. I just think the, the major thing is how do you get people to the webinar in general, but I think specifically, like you and I were talking about the mixing of the text and the webinar, how to kind of remind people at the last minute to come, yeah, like sure. by using a text message. So sure. how to work a system like that. Sure, sure. So here's what I do. For one, you know, I'm launching, um, I have email marketing. So I use email marketing to send an email out to people to make them aware of the webinar. Okay, so email marketing I use to make people aware. Right, and and then once they once that they receive that email, then they can click on the link and they can go to my web page, and so now my web page says, here's the information, here's you know what it is, click here to enroll, okay, and then once they click to enroll, that they're, they're going to pay, and I just use PayPal with my website. Um, which email marketing tool do I use? Well, I use GetResponse. So Constance was asking. I use GetResponse, and GetResponse, I think they had a price range, they, and, they, and mostly all of them that, uh, that have a fee that you have to, a monthly fee, they're gonna give you 30 days to, as a trial for free. And even with the webinars, most of them are gonna give you, you know, the ones that, that you have to pay, 
I'm using, so just so that you know, I'm using GoToMeeting, okay? GoToMeeting. At, in the corporate world, okay, in my full-time job, I use Adobe Connect. Now, two different tools. I like one versus the other for, you know, for some of the corporate things that I do, but for home business type stuff, um, I'm liking GoToMeeting, okay? Um, GoToMeeting is, is a lot more user-friendly. Here's a really key thing that really tipped the scale for me for GoToMeeting for home use, for the home business type stuff that I do and ministries type stuff that I do, is that uh, GoToMeeting makes it user-friendly on a mobile device. So it's mobile support, okay? Mobile device supported. All right, so real quick. So I send out an email to make them aware. Once they um, enroll, and, and matter of fact, even before they enroll. So, so I send out an email. Here's what it is. Here's the date. I send out another series of emails, okay? Um, I also will do a webinar to make them aware of what it is. And at the end of my webinar, I'm, you know, again, pointing to my website, uh, uh, you know, showing what the cost is, savings and everything else there. So I'm doing my selling with the webinar. And then with the webinar, because I have the ability to record, then I'm recording it. And then after it's over on the next day, tomorrow morning, I'm going to send another email using, again, my email service. I'm going to send another email that says, hey, if you missed it, here's what it is. Okay, here's here's you can go and view it. So back up a little bit. How do you get more people to show up? So I'm sending emails, sending reminder emails, and now let's talk about texting. Okay. So easy texting is the tool that I found, and I found, you know, I looked at a couple of different ones. Um, easy texting, I found it's free, number one, and I love using free. I mean, Victoria and I were talking about this. Look, whenever you can get stuff for free and it's going to be tools that you can use to implement your business, hello, Costas is saying, yep, I'm using free stuff, right? Um, so again, the webinar, go to meeting, and hear me when I say this, because I mentioned this on last week, go to meeting, you sign up for free for 30 days, you don't put down, you don't submit your credit card or anything of that nature yet, try it out for 30 days. And then they've got tech support that you can call them, you can chat with them. Um, they will even webinar and video chat with you as well, you know, all for free. And then here's what the guy told me. And when I came down to the end of my 30 days, he says, well, you can get an extension another 30 days, just sign up under another email address. That's what he told me. So I'm like, shucks, I can get 60 days for free? I'm in, and I did my last set of classes where I made that extra cash there, uh, all using the free tool. Okay, so so here's easy texting that I use for free, and the only key thing about some of the free tools that are out there is that sometimes with easy texting, specifically with easy texting, and a, and a few others that I saw, um, you don't get your own keyword they will generate a keyword for you and then it's a free service you have up to x amount of messages that you can send with easy mark uh, easy texting uh, with their marketing campaign tools uh, they literally give you 400 free messages that you can send out to anyone that's on your list on your text list all right so those of you that that join my text list and i'll put it up again so that you can join my text list um, you're going to be added to my to my um, to my contacts list. So it's an online service that I go into my account online and I can see all the people or all the phone numbers that were added, and now I can group them together. I can and I can send a group message, and it will go out to all of those people individually. Okay, 400 text messages per month. Yes, Constance. Yep, per month. Now here's the thing that they do, which I like, is that once I once I signed up and I you know added started adding a few contacts, trying it out, contacts, start trying it out. The next thing that came in when I in, when I went in to log into my account, up comes this message that says, "Hey, get a hundred free um, credits just by answering this poll question." You know, how are you using text messaging? How are you blah blah blah? It's only like two or three questions. I answered it and I got a hundred more credits. Okay, 
cool, right? So I literally have 500 messages that I can send out in this one month. Now, next month, it'll just be, again, at 400, uh, and it'll be continu continually 400 messages. So here's the deal. When you've got 400 credits, that means that you can have 400 people on your list, and you can send one text, and then that uses up all your credits, or you can have, um, or the flip side, where you've got, um, you you got one person and you're sending out 400 messages to them and anywhere in between, okay? Anywhere in between. And it will let you know how many credits you have left. So again, I'm using this to remind people, hey, you know, we've got our, our, our next webinar that's coming up. Okay, so first of all, I'm asking for their permission. Well, let's do this real quick too. Go to my website, quinnmitchell.com. QuinnMitchell.com. Okay, I'm just going to go there real quick so that you can see. When I go to QuinnMitchell.com, here's where what easy texting allows me to do. It allows me to create this widget. So here's what's called a widget, and it creates an HTML code. And I'm using Banzoogle for my website, and it costs me 20 bucks a month. And Banzoogle gives me it gives me a whole lot of stuff. It gives me the ability to embed video, it gives me blogging capability, it gives me, you know, the like us on Facebook type stuff, all these little links here um, for your social media. I've got a welcome, I've got a guest book. Um, uh, the list goes on. Banzoogle, see, so, so it was originally designed for people in the music industry, but it's like, you get all the tools there that you can do everything that you want. And so it doesn't have to be just for music. Band, B-A-N-D, Zoogle, Z-O-O-G-L-E. Now, the other thing that Band Zoogle adds is um, email marketing. So it does add email marketing. The only key thing about what this Band Zoogle doesn't offer with its email marketing, and there's no additional cost. And by the way, $19.99, I got the pro version. There's a step-down version that's like $8.99 a month, okay? Um, and I forget uh, some of the tools that you're just not able to do. I forget. But you can go to Banzoogle and you can check that out. Um, but here's the deal. So the email marketing that Banzoogle offers, there was nothing additional that I had to pay for all these different pieces, blogging, guest book, um, embedding video, you know, the list goes on, right? Creating my, adding my own pages. So I can create my own pages and all. Um, oh, it has their, your, oh, here's the other key thing. Adding audio files and, hear me when I say this, and your own um, shopping cart, okay, for purchases. So people can purchase things right from my website. Um, I can, they can listen to, here, let me just show you real quick the music. And I know I'm getting a little bit off of the subject, but I want to go back. I'm going to show you. So here's all my audios that I can upload. It doesn't cost me anything extra. I can set my prices and people can purchase right, right here for, uh, there's no additional fees that I have to pay for that. And they do not take out any charges, okay? All right, so let me go back to easy texting because easy texting allows me to create my own widget and then I can create my widget. It gives me an HTML code. With my Banzoogle site, I can add my HTML code and then voila, Here's this, you know, area here that you can, person can go to my website and enter in their email, excuse me, enter in their phone number, first name and last name, and just click on join now. And then just like that, they're added to my text list, my easy text list. Okay. So again, that's another way that you can, again, get people to, to be part of your email list, part of your text list. And then I'm texting them as well as emailing them. So I can email them and then follow up with a text, with a text with no additional cost, okay? Text for no cost. Um, now, here's a key thing about the texting, which is pretty cool. So, so let me just go back to uh, sharing my screen again with my PowerPoint. So, Here's the key things to, to know and understand about texting and how this works. So I said to you to text to 313131. That's the short code. Okay. The keyword, my keyword for this free service is, is it's not a customizable keyword. 
it's easy in HV 05160. And you look at that and like, what does that have to do with branding and your business and all? Nothing at all. That's how they get you. If we try this out, you love it, it works for you, then you go to the next plan where you pay for the service and get your own customized keyword. Now I can my, my keyword could be lunch with Quinn is my keyword. Okay. So you get you get a uh, um, uh, a keyword that they create for you. Okay. They create this keyword for you for free. Try it out, test it out. And here's what I'm doing as well. I may never put this on a flyer or billboard or whatever. I may never say text easy to easy in, you know, I don't even remember it. See, that's how, that's how they get you. You don't even remember what this awkward code is or, or keyword is. Um, but if, if I were on Facebook and I say, hey guys, anybody want to join my text list? You know, and I just inbox me your phone number. And I can literally go into my account online and just go add a contact, plug in Victoria's phone number and put her name next to it. Bang, she's added. And then as soon as I add her, she gets a follow-up text message that shows up on her phone. Thanks for joining my you know, text list. Even if they give you a keyword, can you add your own keyword? So here's the deal. There's one, there was a, I think that was Constance was asking. There was one service that I saw where you can, it's for free, you get your own keyword, but you only get up to 25 messages per month for free. Only 25 messages, okay? Um, and with this service as well as with some of the others, um, you can purchase a lot of messages. So you can purchase and say, okay, I ran out of credits, but I wanna get this text message out. Um, then they will charge you like five cents a message. Okay, so you can you can buy messages, buy credits, and so on. All right, so let me share with you real quick what I did. What I did. Yep, there you go, Tanya. So here's my keyword: Easy N H V zero five one six zero. I may communicate that to people. I may not communicate that with people. Totally up to me. Right? Totally up to you. So I did it with you so that you can see what it's like. But look at the space, and then the next word after that space and then lunch with Quinn. Now that's a sub keyword, okay? That's called a sub keyword. So here's my keyword and then my sub keyword, I can create my own with this service, easy texting. With some of the other services that I saw, you can't create your own sub keyword. The one that you, can, that you get your keyword free, okay? You get your keyword free, create your own customized keyword free, but you only get 25 messages then guess what? You can't create your own sub keywords. So here's the deal. Let me just go right into, let me, I'm, I'm getting excited, getting hyped about this, right? So here's the deal. So look for sub keywords. So it's your choice. Here's my deal. I like sub keywords because I get to kind of, you know, do some, well, let me just sign back in again. Um, Hold on real quick. Um, I like having sub keywords because I can do some split campaigning uh, marketing. Okay. So here's my keyword. And I created one keyword, lunch and learned, and I said lunch with Quinn. And, and then with this, I can link it to a group so I can have my own subgroups that I can create. I can have my main group, I can have all my contacts part of my main group, and I can have another group that I'm adding just you guys to, okay? So here's the one I'm using for my ministry, and I've got these different groups within my free account. Let me just go back and show you this real quick. So here's my groups that I can create my own groups, my keyword is that main keyword, and then when someone texts us to that main keyword, then they're going to automatically go into that group called keyword, and, and I can customize and whatever else, right? And then I can have my separate groups. I can create my own separate group. So here's a separate group that I created for you guys, and I called it, you know, 
that's lunch biz and here's my notes there lunch and learn with biz peeps that's what i called it right so when you just did that text to my keyword sub keyword it automatically put you in this group okay so now when i want to send a text message i can go and i can create my own text message and there's phone numbers and all there all right so let me just click off of that real quick so I can I can go here and I can say, you know what, I want to just send a text to one message or I want to send a message to this group. So good question there, Constance. So here's the deal. Um, if you're looking at my screen, here's my here's the group that I created. Here's all you guys right here in my group. I'm just going to type in a quick message. And then I'm going to click on continue, and I, you can see that I only have this group. Yep, there you go. So, so there's a, a hundred and I forget what the what the total amount of characters were. Uh, did you see it was a hundred, 160 characters? There it is. 160 characters is the max for this one message. All right. So now I'm going to click on continue for this sending out the message to this one group, and it lets me know what the message is, how many people there are, how many credits it's gonna eat up. So right down the bottom, it lets me know I've got 443 credits, I've got 100 at any time credits. And if I send it, I'm not gonna do it right now because that'll eat up my four credits, but if I send this message right now, all of you would get a message on your phone that says, hello, testing one, two, three. And it only goes to the people that are in the group that I just selected. So what I'm getting at is, Here's my group, here are my groups. I can create my own groups, right? And then I can click on where it says contacts and then add a contact. So I can, so if I texted you or sent you a message in Facebook that says, hey, uh, you know, you wanna join my text list? And you said, sure, Quinn, I'll be glad to receive messages from you. I said, okay, just send me your, your phone number. And then once you inbox me your phone number, I go here and I type in your phone number and with your first name and then add you to whatever group I want to add you to and save it and then bang, just that easy, you're, you're in that group. And now I can email you, or excuse me, I can text you um, to that whole group or I can text you as an individual because you're now part of my contact. So now when I wanna create a text message, send a text message, I can plug in just your phone number to send you a message only or I can send a message to the group. Questions, questions, this is cool stuff, right? I'm hyped, <laughs> I'm loving it. <laughs> what questions do you have as we're concluding? This is great. I know, right, Tanya? This is cool stuff. Any last minute question? Can you link pictures? So 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 here's the deal. When you go to so linking pictures and video, so there's the SMS texting and then there's the MMS texting. So the MMS texting is a multimedia um, service. And the SMS is a short message service, uh, which is just texting only, 160 characters. So the MMS where, is where you can send video and you can send pictures, and that's what's going to cost you a little bit more. So with the free service, you know, with this free service, you can't send uh, pictures and video. Uh, and then, then, and then, if you want to buy into that plan, it's going to cost you. I believe it was like, eh, I forget what the. It was like, you know. $79 or something like that, I forget. But you can go to Easy Texting Service. Let's just see if I go here, click here, Easy Texting. Um, and by the way, all of you that sent me the text message, Lunch with Quinn, then here are all the messages and there are the phone numbers there. Okay, so that shows up in my, in my account. There's all these messages, right? All right, so here, let's go here real quick. And um, change plan, billing plans. So here's 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 some of the plans. 
the pay there's a pay in as you go plan as well you don't have to pay anything up front you just pay five cents per message but you have to buy a keyword for twenty five dollars a month so you're 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 renting a keyword for twenty five dollars a month for the pay as you go and you just pay for every message you send out otherwise there's the plus the select the elite and so on and so forth all these different options and when you go to the website the easy texting website here let me just show you this real quick you'll see the plans and what the MMS options are view pricing and again this is the one that I like so far there's a there's a ton of them out there this is the one that I tried out and I like so far so SMS meaning just texting only MMS enabled there you go for $49 a month okay so you can get 1,000 SMS but then MMS enabled and then with the MMS enabled um, then you're going to have to you know, potentially pay for additional um, MMS messages okay so again just check it out see if it's worth your while I like it I like free and though it says right here 250 free messages they literally give you 400 free messages and then, then again once you answer the questions they add on another five uh, uh, another hundred to give you 500 to get started okay but again it's the demo keyword that's the one that you don't customize I love free too right yeah I'm loving it all right let's just make sure I, I answered all the questions there real quick um, let's see can you link pictures we did answer that this is great yep uh, okay I think I answered all the questions any any other questions any other questions as we're concluding here? Hey, Quinn, have you looked into trying to combine your email with your SMS? I've been trying to think about that a little bit. Um, so I haven't done that yet, and I know that there's, there's a way to do it, uh, depending on the different services. So there is a, even with easy texting, there is a, I did see somewhere where there was a, um, integration type service but here's okay. the deal right here down the bottom when you go in he, there's this chat area that these guys are just sitting there waiting for you to chat with them <laughs> cool <laughs> and so any questions I have I just did this earlier I sent them a question and they responded and they're just sitting there waiting for you <laughs> and this is a free service okay and you can call them and you can ask some questions so they got tech people there that's just sitting there waiting to, to walk you through and help you out. So again, I'm loving it. <laughs> I'm loving it. Any other last minute questions? How, how do you guys like this lunch and learn? Is this pretty cool stuff? That's awesome. Yeah, yeah. So again, I'm gonna take. I'm gonna. I'm gonna be talking some more in depth about some, you know, webinar classes where I'm showing you the ropes about how to drill in and dig deep and how to create your content, how to sell, how to organize uh, your, your webinars, um, all the do's and don'ts, all the technical type things, um, you know, my preferences, the way that I like to start off, you know, especially in, you know, in the corporate world and then versus, you know, when people are paying for a class, I like to start off on the right foot. So I, I like to start off in this particular way. I'm going to get into a whole lot of that with this class that I'm planning on doing. Uh, Victoria already says she's down. <laughs> so who else yeah, would be interested? Definitely. Who else is interested? Now, I'm just going to share with you, um, you know, when it comes to the marketing and the social marketing side, that's what I'm going to pull in Victoria to say, help me out, Victoria, on this piece. Yep. Of she's going to share with <laughs> us about how to do this with uh, Facebook and all. But as far as like the nuts and bolts of webinars, then um, I'm, I'm, I'm going to show you the ropes there. Okay. So who else is willing? Who else is interested in, you know, a webinar class? And again, it's going to be at a fraction of what those guys would be uh, charging. I'm telling you now, I, I, there's one that I saw just a little bit earlier, a thousand bucks. Okay. I know. I, that's, wow. That's what they're charging. That's what they're charging. I can call out some names of some of those 
individuals and companies, okay? Well, I guess I shouldn't do that, but you see them there. You see them in Facebook. You see their advertisements in Facebook. You go there. They're advertising. They join the free webinar, and before it's all over, they're pitching to you, you know, to join their service, and they're going to teach you the ropes, and their cost is a minimum of nine ninety seven, <laughs> okay? And or you know you can pay that one price of nine ninety seven, uh, close to thousand dollars, right? Or you can pay ninety seven dollars a month for twelve months. I'm telling you, right? I've been there. I I I know what they're charging. Mine's gonna be like just a small fraction of that. On a price range of like 300 bucks, okay? And I'm going to show you a lot of things, almost everything that those guys are doing. All right, so that concludes this Lunch and Learn. Uh, you, you know how to get a hold of me. You know how to text me. You can reply. If you reply to your text, okay, that you received from me, I'm going to see that. And I can go in and I can see your, your, your text message if you're asking me a question or something there. So you can text me to get a hold of me. You know how to get a hold of me in Facebook. You can chat with me in Facebook as well. Um, and, and I'm here to kind of help you guys along the way. Again, being an entrepreneur, doing things part-time, I work a full-time and then do things part-time to kind of help create income stream to pay the bills and you know provide for family, put the kids through college and all. So I know your pain. I know what it's like. So I'm willing to help you out as much as I can, all right? All right. If there aren't any more questions, then I'm going to sign off. And I'm going to stop recording this, and we'll make this recording. We'll see what we do. We'll probably make this recording available to you. So and it looks like we've got Constance, Joey, Tanya, and Victoria. All right. Well, thank you all. And some others were on a little bit earlier and, and uh, signed off. But, hey, this was great. I appreciate you guys chiming in with me and having lunch with me. <laughs> all right. Thank <laughs> you so much, Quinn. This was cool. Good. This was a Yeah, thank year. you, thank you, thank you. Right. We'll talk soon. Bye-bye. Okay, take care. Bye-bye.